Let's review the WWE's post-WrestleMania pay-per-view event, Extreme Rules. And let's review it with a little help from our friends on Twitter. Holy Renee Young. Hashtag Extreme Rules. Hashtag Extreme Cleavage. The opening match was a Chicago street fight featuring Dean Ambrose and Luke Harper. And that match had a weird twist as it took an hour long pause when both Ambrose and Harper drove away in a car. Welp, there goes the new car smell. Harper is justifiably angry after Ambrose spent the last hour fiddling with the car stereo. Sheamus and Dolph Ziggler faced off in a kiss my arsh match. If you're not from Ireland, it's impossible to say arsh without sounding like a douche. Yeah, I'm not watching a hashtag kiss my arsh match in front of my wife or any normal adult. At WWE, you suck sometimes. At Vince McMahon is abnormal. Sheamus' beard looks like it has dingleberries dangling from it. This isn't his first time around the kiss my arsh block. And you know the WWE didn't find the New Day and Tyson Kidd Cesaro match to be that important because it was the only match on the card that actually didn't have its own hashtag. The only thing heelish about New Day is at True Kofi's pigtails and Biggie's breast. I liked New Day better when they were called Men on a Mission. Next up, John Cena defeats Rusev Krush in a Russian chain match. The chain, of course, doused in vodka and being vaguely homophobic, thus rendering it Russian. At least Extreme Rules had an intermission. Hashtag Russian chain match. Common Cena, slow Emawa. The USA is made of. How the f do Lana and Rusev have intercourse? Like, logistically. So it starts with this, and you add this, and you just go, Russia. PG era. The Divas title match featured Nikki Bella defeating Naomi, and featuring Brie Bella, who was wearing a hat that looked very similar to a cartoon character. Brie Bella be like, shh, be very, very quiet. I'm hunting rabbits. And everyone was talking about Naomi's light up shoes. I like Naomi a lot, but her boots look like the bottom of a douchebag's car. Naomi is wearing light up shoes that change color. I don't care about the match anymore. I just want light up shoes. Roman Reigns defeated the big show in a last man standing match. Vince McMahon to the announce table. Okay, you have to make Roman look really, really strong. Damn it. When Roman picked up the table, that was his O face. O, 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 O. This match proves without a doubt that the Spanish announce table needs to be inducted into the Hall of Fame. And the main event of the evening featured a steel cage match with Seth Rollins retaining his title over Randy Orton. I guess RKO banned didn't really mean RKO banned. <laughs> 